All right, what's going on today, guys? We have the beautiful blue Machine Wise Serif configured with the Opus Blade. So this isn't gonna be a really in-depth view. There's already been lots of reviews done on the Serif, um, so I'm not gonna take up your time with like going in-depth with certain details, but this is a Sir Opus. It has that Opus Blade and not a lot of full reviews on that. So this will sort of just touch on a little bit of stuff. So if you're looking at buying this, um, this can hopefully find you and help you. But anyways, let's go ahead and get right into this. This is titanium, um, grade five handles, grade five titanium handles with an SV, I want to say 90, SV, S35VN blade is what the steel is for the blade. And this is a Chanwich. Show you guys that you can see that line running down the back. It is Chanwich. So it's not full channel. So you get a little bit different sound. I'll go ahead and do a sound test right now. So there's that, um, but yeah, and these screws, I think they're stainless steel. If I remember right, I watched a review video on them. These are stainless steel screws, so you really don't have to worry about stripping them, which is super nice. Um, a lot of companies use not so good screw material, and if you use the wrong bit with them, you end up stripping your screws out, and then we all know how that goes. And then it's the battle of how do I get a strip screw out? You know, that's always fun. But yeah, um, I really like this thing. The jimping's really nice on it. The grip, there's not a whole lot of grip on these handles, but the grip that there is um, does help a lot. So I do like that. If I can flip right now, my hands are sort of cold. Um, another feature that I like is it's got a really nice chamfer all the way down the blade. And then there's this. You'll notice that the edge doesn't start till about right here, that far up the blade. See if I can get that in there. Yeah, right there. So you could technically probably get away with doing a bite handle chaplain on this knife. Um, if you accidentally made that mistake, I don't think it would punish you as hard as say a Talisong Z would or something like that. I know you all just died in your chairs as I dropped this thing, but yeah. Um, I really do enjoy this thing. It flips nice. Um, due to the materials that I think this thing uses, you know, the grade 5 titanium handles, the S35V blade, VN blade, I do think, and the machining that's put into it, because there's a lot of intricate work on the inside of the handles with the weight system and all that, I do think it is worth the price tag of $650. I do think it's worth it. Um, if you're new into the hobby, I don't recommend this. You don't need something that's expensive to get started. But, yeah. If you want to spend your money on it, go ahead. You definitely won't be disappointed. But, but that's my opinion. So, anyways, I think that's going to be it for today's video, guys. If you have any questions at all about this thing, just let me know down in the comments. I'll definitely hook you up with answers and all that other good stuff. So... Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.